relief could be on the way for thousands of Michiganders who are having trouble paying their 2020 summer property taxes. Michigan Senate Bill 243 would amend current property tax laws and grant relief to business and residential property owners who have fallen behind on their summer 2020 taxes due to the pandemic. Senator Michael McDonald is sponsoring this legislation. He says $300 million has already been earmarked to fund the effort. And, it, and it's just obvious that why, you know, the people who've been penalized for this, for things that are out of their control, the state should help them with. So I think it's a no-brainer. The proposal would allow property owners to apply to the Michigan Department of Treasury by April 15th to have the state pay for any interest or penalties charged for unpaid summer taxes. Ingham County Treasurer Eric Scherzing says he's confident the bill will gain approval. Probably everybody on both sides of the political aisle is, is supportive of relief to, to businesses and individuals that are struggling from you know, COVID or other things related to COVID that, that caused them to fall behind on property taxes. You know, there's, there's, there's money that the, the governor and the legislature have, have set aside to help with a program like this. Clinton County Treasurer Tina Ward says delinquent tax bills for the summer of 2020 were just turned over to county treasurer offices this month. She says the number of delinquencies has dropped. In Clinton County, our delinquency rates for the 2020 property taxes have actually decreased. Um, our delinquency rate for 2020 is 2.38% in Clinton County versus 2019 property taxes, our delinquency rate was 2.64%. Ward says she thinks delinquencies are down because people use stimulus payments to stay current on their bills. Schertzing agrees. It's also true that folks got the, the stimulus dollars. and When those checks hit bank accounts, we see payments. You know, there's a, there's a direct connection between those two events. So we're, we're really, 2021 looks very much like 2020. Senator McDonald is hoping the bill will come up for a vote when the legislature reconvenes on April the 12th. Clinton County Treasurer Tina Ward says anyone who is struggling to pay their property taxes should reach out to their county clerk immediately because there are already many programs that are in place that can help. Your neighborhood Capitol Beat reporter Erica Murphy, Fox 47 News.